For round two, we need to work eight increase. Yarn over and pull through the loop on hook to work one chain stitch at the beginning. This chain stitch would not count as needed stitch of each round. We can now continue crocheting the later parts using the pre-started crochet piece that came with the kit. Insert hook into the first stitch. We can put the yarn tail on hook while crocheting to hide it. Yarn over and pull yarn through. Yarn over and pull yarn through two loops on hook to work one single crochet. Mark this first stitch. Insert the hook into the same stitch and work another single crochet. Two single crochet in the same stitch equal one increase. So now, we got one increase, see to stitches. Insert hook into the next stitch and work to single crochet to make one increase. Got two increase, see for stitches. Repeat with six more increase. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. If you have more than 16 stitches, and do them until you have each two stitches in the 8 stitches of round 1. This is the slip stitch and this is the chain stitch. They are not counted as the needed stitch of each round. So, we need to skip these two stitches and insert hook into the marking stitch to work one slip stitch. Yarn over and pull through. Pull the first loop through the second loop. Okay, we finished round two, 